Hello and welcome to another Wow Power video review. Today we're actually going to uh, go over unlocking your Galaxy Nexus from Docomo. It's the SC-04D. This is the Japanese Docomo version of the Galaxy Nexus. And it's SIM locked. Unlike most other GSM Galaxy Nexus, Nexus this one is locked to the Docomo uh, network. And uh, you see I have a SoftBank, a competing uh, uh, network. And uh, I put a uh, SoftBank card in there. And uh, when I start it up, it's locked. And I hope you can see this fairly clear. It's uh, I, I just got the phone. It's brand new. You can see it even still has the plastic on it. That's how it comes. Anyway, um, I'm going. you have to put a lock code in there. And I do that at Docomo. You can pay 3,000 yen. Um, or you can get one online from uh, genuine sim, GenuineSamsungUnlock.com. I'm going to dismiss this. Anyway, so I've already gone through the phone. Um, I've already rooted it as well. So there's another way to unlock it. And that's to use the Fuck Docomo app. And uh, it's, you can't get it on the market. Um, if you go to XDA developers and type in the fuckdocomo.apk, you should be able to find it. And then uh, you have to download it um, and donate. This guy did a lot of work to, so we don't have to pay for unlocks. Anyway, um, I'm going to start it up. I've installed it. it. You need to root your phone and get super user permissions. And then you, what you'll do is you're going to run the unlock. And I don't know how well you can see that, but it says uh, unlock Docomo Galaxy Nexus SIM lock. If if it shows something like typing PIN code type 1234, donate, and it gives you a place to donate with PayPal. Um, so donate. This APK has no insurance. Um, it's unintended uh, pregnancy events. I have, to do, I have nothing to do. Okay, kind of funny. All right, so you have two versions, unlock and unlock forever. Uh, unlock. If you just hit unlock, which I'm going to do, um, it uh, will return back to the SIM lock if you flash or if you flash another image on your phone or if you um, do a factory update to a new version of uh, if you do anyway flash to a new or you get an over the air update. So then you just have to run the app again. The forever unlock won't won't do that. It, the forever unlock will uh, stay unlocked. However, it changes your IMEI number to a generic one, and uh, so you don't get the same. This has the IMEI number on here, and uh, this will keep your original um, IMEI number. So I suggest just doing the temporary unlock. Anyway, I'm going to hit unlock. And if you notice here, it also says you can lock again. So you, after you've unlocked it, you can hit lock again, and it will um, and it will restore it back to the SIM lock state. So if you have to bring it back to Docomo or something like that. Anyway, done, need reboot, wipe system reset, need lock again, keep IME, donate. Okay, so I'm going to hit unlock unlock and it's got asking me for super user emissions okay now i'm going to reboot power off off and then um after you reboot we'll see if it works and i've actually already done this i've already tested this and uh, i had it have my t-mobile sim let me start up there buddy thank you there you go i have a t-mobile sim as well and it worked with t-mobile and now i'm testing with softbank so uh, we'll get it started. You can watch this uh, startup screen. Um, right now, the Galaxy Nexuses are very cheap on Docomo, and so that's why uh, we got a bunch of them for everybody at our office because they were like uh, less than $300 or about $300. So let's go. Oh, also, uh, I flash this to the 4.0.2 uh, ROM. I just got it from the... Uh, the uh, Google website. Okay, here we are. You notice that? There was no SIM. There's no SIM lock. So now it's working. And look at, I'm getting blue bars for the, uh, don't know if you can see that, but I'm getting the blue bars, meaning that I can make a phone call. And then if I go and do an IMEI check, star pound zero six. And uh, yep, that's my original IME. I don't actually want you to see that, but there you go. The original IME is still there and it's unlocked. So uh, it works great. One thing I want to show you is uh, let me go run the doggy file explorer. Um, it saves it. It makes a backup to your uh, to the SD card storage. Um, it's called unlock dash backup. Uh, so back that up onto your computer because uh, if you flash your if you flash the phone um, it, with a permanent unlock, it erases that folder and then you can't restore your SIM SIM unlock or or your IME number. So save that. And uh, that's it. Uh, enjoy your happy new unlocked phone. Thanks for watching.